Well, 17th century British philosopher John Ray summed it up. Money begets money. Nowhere is that surer than in the world's currency exchanges. And Maya Kaliki has taken an inside look at making money with currency. Maya? The foreign exchange market, or Forex, is the most liquid market in the world, with a traded value of about $1.9 trillion a day. That's more than 30 times the money that flows through the New York Stock Exchange most days. The Forex used to be inaccessible to individual investors, but electronic trading networks like the one offered by MG Financial Group have changed that. With the um, internet growing as fast as it's been growing in the last few years, um, it's now possible for any uh, investor to simply have an internet ready computer and just log in and trade much like uh, stocks have developed uh, with companies like E-Trade. Uh, it's now possible to trade the currency market just the same way. But it's not just the same because of leverage. Slight moves in currency prices can yield tremendous profit, but there's tremendous risk as well. And knowledge is critical. There are a dizzying number of currency combinations. We're trading the euro against the dollar, the dollar against the yen, the sterling against uh, the dollar. Not to mention global events to keep track of. Currency trading is not for everyone. In fact, regulations require that companies offering currency trading online inform investors about risk and ask individuals about their income figures and net capital. We're not talking about a housewife with uh, you know $12,000 of income per year and $500 in assets. That's just not a realistic investor for uh, something like foreign exchange trading. But a sophisticated individual with substantial risk capital has a new trading opportunity available around the clock. All right, Maya, thanks very much.